We have the original Team Rocket Wizards of the Coast set that came out in 1999, I believe. Hi, Heart Squad. I still don't have my studio ready, so in the meantime, I'm having to come up with creative alternatives, like filming in my new dining room that doesn't have any furniture. But what it does have is this, a mystery box filled with over $500 of Pokemon card products, which includes vintage booster packs from Wizards of the Coast, sealed booster boxes of Pokemon cards, and lots of other stuff. This was actually sent to me from an aspiring YouTuber called Little Big Kid. By the way, I would choose Squirtle for sure. But this guy, very, very kind. He sent me this to open up. It also includes this note that says, But let's go ahead and read the notes and I'll try to do it in haste and then we shall open up everything. Well, I'm gonna open up everything. If they're sealed boxes, they will be opened up in this video. So if you can, give this video a big old thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. So, this is what the note says from there. To Leonhart, I've been a longtime fan and follower all the way from down under Australia. I wanted to thank you for everything you've done, not only what you've done for yourself, but everything you've done for the community as well. That's you. You've been a big, big influence on the continued success of the Pokemon franchise. Well, thank you. You've also influenced not only my love for Pokemon, but my interest in YouTube. You've helped me convince myself to start my own journey despite originally being nervous to do so. Check out my channel. Little Big Kid. You can go check out his channel as soon as you're done watching this video, of course. Here's some stuff for you. Hope you enjoy and may the card fairies be ever in your favor. Regards, Gus, aka Little Big Kid. So, we have this. I wanna try to open this as non-awkwardly as I can on camera. Obviously, my usual setup with the better audio and everything is being currently set up. Is this, what, oh my gosh. What's, what's a lovely box that has lots of tape on it? So, oh, okay, here we go. All right, let's see what's on the inside. Oh my gosh. Right off the bat, it's filled with Wizards of the Coast vintage cards. Tons of booster packs. Oh, there's more, it's, it's, like, it's like Christmas and Hanukkah. Tons of booster packs. Like lots and lots, oh. Oh my gosh. Team Rocket sealed Wizards of the Coast booster packs, everybody. We're opening these, of course. We also got random, like, Malo Ultra Rare Full Art Trainer card. We got Wick. She's, uh, she's from the 60s, apparently. Lunala GX. Hopefully the light's not making this so shiny for y'all, which shiny's good, by the way. Reshram GX is very cool. And let's take a look at these. Uh, I'll show you these cards individually. Look at this. It's, it's, it's more. It's, it's presents for everybody. So a Jungle Pikachu card. Very cool. Dratini Team Rocket. Dark Flareon is pretty cool. Dark Vaporeon. So we got Team Rocket Jungle. My favorite Squirtle of all time. Purely for nostalgic sake, this Squirtle Team Rocket. Charmander from Team Rocket. Oh, we got some, uh, it's a Japanese tag team card. This was like the very first one. Umbreon GX Ultra Rare, and some Evolutions, a Mega Venusaur EX. So, pretty cool assortment of random cards right off the bat. We got this, we got this. So, uh, let's go ahead and just for sake of mystery, I'll, uh, I'm gonna open this. Well, I'm just opening it up. I don't know what it is. Hopefully y'all can see it. Oh, <gasps> there's graded PSA cards. Okay, okay, okay. Are you ready? I, I, let's see what the first one is. Oh, -ho, a Gem Min 10. So evolutions, more evolutions. A Gem Min 10 Mega Venusaur EX. That's gorgeous. What's next? What's next? Are you ready to see you? Is that a Gardevoir GX from Burning Shadows, PSA 9? Wow. We have three more of these. Whoa, 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 what set is that? Is that a Skyridge or 
2003 Aquapolis Electrode Near Mint Mint 8. Look at Electrode. Is he finally not pissed off in a card? Usually he's always pissed off in cards, but this one, look at that. There's nothing like the E-Series of Aquapolis Expedition and Sky Ridge. Some of the best illustrations you will ever see. So very nice vintage one, another. This is Japanese, these two. Ooh, Near Mint 7 Dark Golbat from Team Rocket. Very cool. And last but not least, a Zapdos. Is that base set? Yeah, 1996 base set. Zapdos Japanese. That's crazy. All right, let's go with opening up this and we got lots of packs to get through today as well. So hopefully, oh, oh, it's a GX. We're going shiny hunting. We're going shiny hunting. To Man, I'm like 10 years old over here. Hope the windows are open so people can walk by and be like, what is this guy doing? We are opening up this whole box today as well. We still got these sun and moon packs and oh yeah. We got Team Rocket packs as well. And then this, this is incredible. <gasps> no way, it's, it's a Japanese set of Team Up. At least I think it is. Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff in this. There is a lot of good stuff in this. Shall we get started? All right, uh, I think I'm going to start with some of these sun and moon packs, and then when I get tired of these, I'll move into something different. So once again, bear with me, everybody. I appreciate your patience as I'm spoiling the cards until I get my new studio. I'm hard at work at it, so I appreciate y'all's patience. All right, Lean Hearts trademark, patent head, guess the energy game, psychic energy. All right, let's see how just uh, holding these, I think they're coming in focus and everything. Ultra Ball, a Mahuhita, Shelder, Togedomaru, Popleo. We got lots of stuff to go through, so I'll try to do these a little bit faster than normal, but I'm really excited how the progress of my studio is coming along. It's, it's gonna be state of the art. Y'all are gonna love it. Um, Leaf. All right, we got Metal Energy, Energy, Recycler, Wishy Washy, Alolan, Eradicate, Stuffle, Wingle, Dratini, Lillipop. Oh, is that a, uh, just an Uncommon and a Parasect. Continuing on, the cards that you would want to pull in Sun and Moon, this is the original Sun and Moon base set that came out a few years back, would be the Secret Rare Ultra Ball, which is the card, Leaf again, that I pulled in the library. Still to this day, the most popular video on this channel, if you wanna go watch it, I finally pulled the Ultra Ball card after searching through well over a thousand packs. And, uh, oh, Pre-Marina GX. And I pulled it out of all the places that you can pull a card and not get excited about, it was in why is this so difficult to open? It was in the library out of all places. And obviously I recorded my reaction to it. I was there when I pulled it. And so it was very, very embarrassing because it looks like I was crying in the video, but I was not water energy. It, I, I was, if anything, they were tears of happiness is what they were. Togedomaru, Poplio, Zubat, Carvana, and a head and shoulders card. Holographic, okay, okay. More, more, more. Sun and moon to go. This is such a uh, kind of little pig kid to send us this box, fairy energy. Yay! It's uh, very kind of him, so definitely go check out their channel because all of this together is just an incred incredible amount of money to uh, send this for us to open up today. And uh, Cosmoem is the non-holographic rare. There's like a GX Ultra Shiny booster box alone, which we're gonna open up later on this video, goes for $100. So just that, and all these vintage cards and packs, like the Team Rocket packs, I'll say fighting. Uh, those Team Rocket packs are probably at least like $30 to $40, if not more. Uh, the times change, and so the prices of those packs do change, and so they're probably more than what I saw before. The Rare! Hariyama Non-Holographic Rare. Next up is, well, 
another Sun and Moon base set pack. There's a lot, there's still quite a bit of these. So I'll probably switch shortly to the GX box because I really want to get to it. And then later on, Leaf, we will open up those three Team Rocket Vintage Booster Packs. Morlo, Fomantis, Spiro, Pick a Pack, a Oranguru and a Sandcastle. So I think I'll open up maybe just like one or two more of these base set packs and then it's time to move on. So uh, I'll probably open more later on the water, ah, later on in the video, but Hypno, Potion, Splenda, Zubat, Popleo, Stuffle, sorry I'm blocking my handsome face, and the rare is another Cosmoem. So this will be the last Sun and Moon pack for right now. And then it is shiny time. Four cards, I'm gonna go with Psychic Energy. Oh, I can see it, but y'all must just, y'all got it, obviously. I didn't get the Guessy. I got the Guessy Energy game like one time, so. Which is actually kind of impressive. And the rare is a beware. All right, so this is a GX Ultra Shiny box for people that don't know. Shiny Charizard. Probably the most sought after card in the set other than the Full Art Cynthia card is in the set. And I've been searching, I've opened up I don't know, 20-ish boxes of this so far on this channel, and it's been such a fun ride. Uh, just the uh, Monday's video, I opened up two of these boxes, and I pulled one of the most expensive cards from the set. If you wanna go watch that video, I will leave it in the eye, wherever it is. These are all the packs, 10 packs. There are guaranteed shiny Pokemon cards in these packs, so uh, sit tight. This is gonna be fun. Especially if we get the shiny Charizard, odds are we probably won't. I have pulled three of the Cynthia cards, so no Guess the Energy game, so you get to go right into this. Quagsire, uh-oh, Copycat, Gibble, Combuskin, Inke, and a shiny Ralts! Right off the bat in the lights! Make it shine even more! I'm having way too much fun with this. Like seriously, thank you little big kid for sending this. So our first shiny of the day, Delphox, Type Null, Golisopod. There are no Shatter Foil cards when you get a shiny Pokemon and I'm fine with that. Shatter Foil are essentially the reverse rares of this set. There are still no plans for this set to come out in English. It would be, it would be absolute mayhem if this were to come out in English. Goodbye wallet even more. Alolan Ninetales, uh, Solgaleo, Greninja, and a Nicole Kidman. All right, continuing on with this random assortment of packs in Hither In. Why is this so difficult to open up? All right, three cards. Hopefully you're not able to see the cards when I'm doing the card trick. We got Volkner. An Alolan Executor, Nicole Kidman again, Snover, Ralts, Pachirisu, Blaziken, Dusme, Necrozma, Savali, Seviper, Shattered Foil. See, they're very, very cool looking. Ooh, that is such a gorgeous shiny Pokemon that we pulled so far. Oh, wow. I see somebody outside the window right now. Hopefully they're not spying on me. All right, so here we go. They're gonna be like, hey, look, it's that Pokemon guy. Wishful Batten, Rotom, Energy Recycler. I think that's a Sneasel. Wooper, Sableye. Oh, nothing special. I thought it was a shiny for a second. And there we go, so the rest of those. Going just a little bit faster because there is an entire Tag Team GX booster box to open up. And so uh, let's, we'll get, we'll get to that Vino very shortly, but this is kind of the set that I am just really ecstatic about. My little stack of cards over here is about to implode on itself. Riolu, uh, Sneasel, Guzzlord, Guardchomp, Glaceon, and a Guzzlord Shattered Foil card. All right, as long as I don't, uh, get like a Hydreigon and a Zwellius and all that stuff. I always get those confused with these cards. Uh, Lolan Marowak, Cynthia, very cool, Execute, Poipo, a Frogadier, and there's another, ah, oh, it's a shiny! Another shiny, shiny alert, shiny alert. So there we go, our second pull. What, huh? Huh, huh? 
Was that an air pack? Two shinies in one pack? This has got to be an air pack. What? Drampa the Grandpa, full art shiny right behind another. I am uh, in shock right now. Is there another? No, just a Zekrom and a Hydreigon. That is uh, one pack, two shinies, full art. Wow, I am in shock right now. I've never had any, I've opened up tons of boxes. Is that something, is that possible for other people have seen it in other channels that you can get two shinies in one pack? I've never heard of that before. Anyway, as I'm getting, may, maybe, will we get four shinies in one box? Is that even possible? Magnazone, Lycanroc, and uh, Sherry? So yeah, we'll just put her over there. So we have three packs remaining and uh, usually you only get two of those regular shinies and then the full art shinies and then that is it. However, if we get four, this will be unprecedented. Tutorinator, let me make sure I put the card over there. Rotom, Energy, Rock Rough, Wimpod, Darkrai, Altaria, Ultra Necrozma GX, and a Pachirisu Shattered Foil card. So uh, two more of these GX Ultra Shiny packs to go. I still have three of these boxes sealed up, so I will be opening up more. What if we get the Shiny Charizard and just make it the most craziest box you've ever seen? You've ever seen? Magirna, Guzma. I pulled the full art Guzma in the other video the other day. It was pretty exciting. Froki, uh, Feromosa, Manaphy, Rushrum, and a Hoopa Shattered Foil card. So, this is what we got from the box. And we have one pack left. There's a chance. If this is an air box, there will be a shiny in this pack. If this is not an air box, then we just got, for some reason, they put the shiny in one pack. So uh, let's see, this is this is gonna hold all the cards here. Malamar, bodybuilding dumbbells, fan, ro whoa! Sorry about that. Head and shoulders, rock rough, Eevee, and I think, uh, okay, I think uh, Zygarde, Necrozma, Tapu Lele, and a shattered foil rock rough. So for some reason, or because I'm just crazy like that and wasn't paying attention, one pack held our shinies. So that is it for the GX box. I'll put those cards over yonder. We do have these three packs left. And uh, also this box. Now I'm pretty sure it's a tag team poke up, like a tag team team up box, or it's the newest set, which Unbroken Bonds, which now that I think about it, this could be the newest set on Broken Bonds, which obviously we're gonna be opening up, but like, oh gosh, okay, all right, here we go. So unless I'm just completely confused right now, which that happens a lot in my videos, as you'll see from time to time. Time to time. All right, so, uh, whoa, that's a lot of packs. I, uh, there's only five cards in each of these packs, but uh, yeah, so, uh, here we go. So, is this uh, Unbroken Bonds or Team Up? Not really sure, but uh, I'll just go through these a little bit faster. So, okay. There we go. It's a nice little Iki, Inke. Did I say Inke? Iki? His name is Iki. If this is Unbroken Bonds, and I apologize, I don't really follow, I haven't opened up a set of it yet, then I'll go maybe a little bit slower while I go through these, because this is my first time seeing these. And so that was nice. We did get, I think that was a hollow in that first one. If it is Unbroken Bonds, which is the English equivalent that is coming out in May, there are, there's the Charizard. Oh my gosh, Weeping Bell, how you doing? There is, oh, very nice. There is a Charizard card. Yes, once again, in this set. And it is one of the most gorgeous cards that you can get. It's awesome, oh Pikachu! He's winking at us, how you doing? 
It's one of the most gorgeous cards you're gonna uh, see. However, apparently it's incredibly difficult to get. And I'm not sure if it was like the other Pokemon in the card. It was like one of, it was a tag team card. So I'm not exactly sure which Pokemon was the second Pokemon on the card. I don't think it was a Lugia. It may be like a, like a Zekrom or something. Togepi is very cute. This is like some good artwork on these. I'm very genuinely excited about this set then. It's gotta be the newest set. So uh, if not, there's plenty of people that would just let me know in the comment section. All right, so, uh, what, oh, Victory Bell. Man, do they, oh my gosh. Do they make these cards like the creepiest cards you've ever seen? Jeez, all right. Don't forget, guys, uh, if I don't get to the Sun and Moon packs, I'll get right into these Team uh, Team Rocket packs right after this. Ooh, is that a Greninja? Pretty cool looking card. It's a Spritzy, Spritzy! All right, there are only five cards in this uh, each of these packs compared to the GX ones, so it makes it go by a little bit faster. Oh, Raichu, very cool. Uh, but at the same time, there's a lot of packs. Way more, there's double than in the GX box, so. All right, so, so far we've only, is that a Marshadow? We've only pulled holographic, so there's probably guaranteed at least some sort of trainer card or a full art card. There's a Nintendo GameCube, that's pretty cool to see. All right, and uh, some trainer card, which I don't know, so. The pack arts for these, just Zoroark and Greninja, uh, pretty cool looking, nothing too crazy. And a uh, Venomoth. Okay, pretty crazy looking, nice eyes. Little uh, too much, you know, lights probably, but there we go, Venomoth. Uh, okay, Venomoth, okay. Oh my gosh. What if I just went straight into opening up that Team Rock? There's so much stuff on my desk in front of me right now. I'm just like, what if I went straight into opening that? Ooh, surprise Gengar box. Very cool, what is that? Okay, Kiram. And lots of trash at the same time. So remember guys, uh, definitely give this video a big old thumbs up. It really does mean a lot to me. And uh, I appreciate it, appreciate the support. Is that another fairy charm, maybe? Okay, there's still a decent amount of these packs left. So full art chances, very cool. Radicate, another Togepi. Oh, it's so cute! Okay, I've now passed on the cuteness phase in wanting to continue opening up the packs phase. What else have we got? Frogadier, Pikachu, Bellsprout, Clefable, and there's the trainer card, which I don't really know what it is. All right, next up. I have to say, I'm gonna, I'm very genuinely excited for the set. There is some sort of hammer. Must be uh, MC Hammer's Hammer, okay, I'm just dating myself right now. All right, Rattata, what else do you got for us? Unbroken Bonds, another holographic pool, so it's pretty cool, it's a little bit different than when I'm so used to opening up GX Ultra Shiny packs, where you're guaranteed a uh, GX card, you're guaranteed a Shatter 4, you're guaranteed like shiny Pokemon. And then you get back to a set like this. Oh, we got a tag team. We got a tag team. What is it? What is it? Oh, it's, it's the people in the Sacred Ninja and Zorark. Very cool. Zorark just chilling on the side or on the tree or whatever. So, all right, getting confused here. We got about uh, maybe eight more packs of this. And that was our first tag team pull. We still have, uh, there's still a chance, probably. Probably gonna pull a full art of the sorts, so get ready for that. Let's uh, see it. Is that a Tentacruel or Tentacool? <laughs> I was not trying to joke around there. All right, continuing on. Team Rocket Vintage Wizards of the Coast pack coming up. What is that? Okay, very cool. You're very cool. Continuing on. Must continue until we pull something really cool that I can go crazy about. Ratata, Frogadier, Sharpedo. Wow. Welcome back, Sharpedo. Like, where's all my Sharpedo fans out there? There's, there's gotta be Sharpedo fans. Oh, is that another hollow? Yes. And lots and lots of spritzies. Really uh, going for the spritzies there. All right, there's a Pikachu. 
some trainer and a Clefable. We have four packs, so really, really hoping that we do get that full art very soon. We probably should. Carvana, na na na. And is that a Quagsire? Just kind of chilling by a boat. Next up, we have three more packs of this. Anything could happen. Is that a Gligar? Yes, it is. Oh, another tag team. Greninja, oh, that's another one. It's another one. So we have two different versions of this card. Pretty cool. Definitely let me know uh, which is your favorite. So we have two more packs of this. Two more packs. Lickitung, Tentacruel, Licky Licky. And there's Ninja Boy, Ninja Boy. So this is the final pack. And uh, I guess I would be a little upset if we didn't get any full arts or secret rares. But in any case, this has been quite the experience and a Raichu. So pretty cool for the newest set that will be coming out in May. Um, I have tons and tons of cards. So I have this many Sun and Moon packs. I am going to open I want to go ahead and just open up the Sun and Moon packs because I said I was going to open up everything in this video in the box and I just I just want to do it. I could get something very nice. Leaf. All right. Water energy. But there's something very, very shiny coming up at the end of this and it could be an ultra rare. It could be secret rare. All oh, Tauros. Okay. Okay. Not too bad. I'll try to speedy Gonzalez this, uh, this part. Four card guess the energy game. I'll say fairy energy. Oh, I can instantly see the disappointment when I guess the energy game wrong. So Cosmog, Rog and Rolla, the San Francisco treat, Stoutland. Or did I, say, am, am I saying the football club in, in England right now? All right, next up. I'm gonna say water right off the bat. Metal energy, all right. Is that a nest ball? Pettis, Lillipop, uh, Dupiter, Marini, Growlithe, and the rare is a Decidueye. So don't go nowhere. Very shortly, I'm opening up these three Wizards of the Coast packs. And once again, thank you, Little Big Kid, for sending us this box to open. Leaf. Fairy energy. How many Guess the Energy games have I gotten in this? Maybe like two and I've opened up a ton of packs. Then again, a lot of them have been Japanese packs and I don't do the Guess the Energy game for that. And the red, oh, Nest Ball. I thought it was the Ultra Ball for a sec, but that's still gorgeous. Secret Rare Nest Ball pull. Yes, yes, yes. That is great. All right, bear with me. Four more sun and moon packs to go, and we shall be done with sun and moon. Here we go. Uh, I saw it, so I was I, I, I was going to say dark energy. That's exactly right. That counts. All right. Okay. Fine. Never mind. Snubble, pick a pack. Carvana, na na na. Double colorless energy and Incineroar. Non holographic rare. But like I said, uh, videos. I guess not in this video, but. Videos are still as normal. Uh, Monday, Wednesday, fire energy. Oh my gosh, I saw it. Uh, Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, 1 p.m. Central Standard Time, I post videos. You can guarantee they're gonna be posted for the most part. Togedemaru and, oh, a Lorantis. Kevin Lorantis GX. Very cool. Can't believe we got a secret rare from these. So a secret rare nest ball would probably be one of the best pulls from this. I'll say lightning. Psychic energy. All right, what else? Do we, what else do we got here? Marini, Cribrawler, Eevee. The trash on my desk is crazy right now. Team Skull and a, is that Polyrath? Yeah, Polyrath holographic card. Okie dokie. Last sun and moon pack. I unfortunately, We'll probably not go over all the pulls, but uh, you can just go rewind the video if you wanna go check out all the vintage cards that I was sent, Leaf, and uh, just, yeah, go see me shock in awe over how kind Little Big Kid is. So, 
Uh, and of course, for y'all for watching this video too. I appreciate it. Uh, how you doing? Toucan Sam, he wants his Fruit Loops back. He's coming good. Blah. Okay. Sorry about that. Sometimes I get a little crazy. We have the original Team Rocket Wizards of the Coast set that came out in 1999, I believe. So, just a cool casual 20 years ago, these packs were released. So, 11 additional cards. I uh, don't know the card trick necessarily, so I try to save the pack art if possible. Let's see, I believe, uh, is there a secret Raichu in this set? Secret or Raichu? I don't know. Anyway, I'll just do three cards. I probably did the card trick wrong. And a very nice Dark Cadabra, Dark Vaporeon. You slow down for these packs because they're gorgeous. Ponyta, Magnemite, Meowth. Ooh, very cool. Coughing, Rattata, Grimer. Oh, there we go. Is that hollow? No, but I don't care. Dark. Charizard card. Very nice way to start off these vintage packs. Still got two more, including this one. Probably my favorite pack art of all the Team Rocket ones. Cool to see Kadabra as well. So I did do the card trick right. So yay for doing the card trick right. Oh, Dark War Turtle. He's up to no good. What is he doing there? Dark Golduck, Abra, Psyduck, Ekans, do the Mankey Leg, Machop, Dark Radicate, Slowpoke, and a Dark Dragonite. Non holographic rare, but very cool nonetheless. So, this is the last pack of Team Rocket. We were sent PSA cards, including an Aquapolis Vintage Hollow. We had some incredible pulls over here. We opened up an Unbroken Bonds box for what I think it is. Definitely guys, please do go check them out and also leave a thumbs up for the support. And share this video too. This has been, we opened up so much stuff in this video and I would appreciate it. From vintage packs to the newest stuff, this has been a lot of fun. So last Team Rocket pack, let's go out in style, maybe get a holographic Dark Charizard. I'll take it. Can we get a Squirtle, please? Can we get a Squirtle? There it is! Oh, I, I swear, I had no idea. I had no idea. I just love it. It's so cute. It's a nostalgic Squirtle from Team Rocket. Snorlax, how you doing? Diglett, Ponyta, and... That's not the last one. All right. Here! Oh, Dark Doug Trio. So, once again, Thank you so much, Little Big Kid, for sending us this. This was a treat, Heart Squad. No more videos coming up starting tomorrow once again. My name is Lean Heart. Stay awesome, stay positive, and as always, I will see y'all in the next video.